Fifth grader Peyton Moyer of Kansas City loves to eat radishes. She grew this one herself. My family doesn't really like them, but I like them. I don't know why. They're just really good. Moyer loves to garden. She tends to a garden at home and one at her school. The process of watching things grow is pretty cool to me because not only do you get to see it starting to sprout up and see it gets taller almost every day, but you get to like take care of it like it's something that you really like. A University of Missouri Extension program called Eating from the Garden has kids growing their own produce at school. The program is in more than 27 schools and community centers in the Kansas City area. The MU Extension Nutrition Garden Coordinator says school gardens give kids more exposure to fruits and vegetables. It's good. There's lots of momentum right now with society with the going green and the gardening um, aspect of nutrition and it's a really fun way to teach kids how to be healthy. Green onions, fresh cilantro. Chef Mark Zukaitis shows kids easy recipes for snacks right from the garden. We're not looking to do anything that's difficult. We're just trying to show fun ways to have easy, healthy, nutritious snacks for children and their families. Mm. Eating healthier <laughs> snacks can help children avoid obesity and other conditions such as type 2 diabetes. The MU Extension specialists say they're planting a seed. If they bring this education home to their families and influence the people that are going to the grocery store and buying the stuff, then that's going to show up in the cupboards and in the refrigerators. It's going to be fresher food if they're the ones, you know, having some input in what the family's eating. Moyer says gardening has now turned into a hobby. Her sisters like to go to the mall, but not her. Moyer would rather be working the soil. And then when I go home, I just garden. It takes my mind off of a lot of stuff. It's pretty good. It's From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting.